I woke up to a surprise today. My wife said I had a delivery. And I was very surprised because I didn't expect these until Monday. And actually FedEx delivered them on Sunday. So Sunday morning, these arrived. So, gonna do a quick unboxing. Just in case there's something really interesting or something happens that I want to have a video of. And then I'll come back and we'll talk about why I purchased these specific item. And what is it? Well, it's lithium ion batteries. These are brand new. from Big Battery. Now there's some specific reasons why I bought these. And I purchased two of these 202 amp hour batteries. These are not 100 amp hour, these are not 170 amp hour, these are the new 202 amp hour lithium ion batteries. And 13.1 volts. On delivery. Well, that's the first one. Boy, that, that is a beautiful case. I paused the video because I put my knife down and then I didn't know where I put it. Guys, this is what happens when you get old. You put things down and then forget where you put them. You ever go into a room in your house and you get there and you forgot why you went there? Yeah, that's what happens when you get old too battery. Alright, this should be identical to the first one. So, each one of these is rated at 202 amp hours. And boy, they package these beautifully. Absolutely wonderful. Alright, I'm going to put that knife right on top of the other battery. Very cool. Big battery. And battery number two. So both of these are rated at 202 amp hours. There's a specific reason or several specific reasons why I purchased these batteries and uh, we'll get into that next. I wanted to tell you a few reasons why I chose these lithium-ion batteries. I purchased these direct from the website just like you can so nobody provided these to me for free. Um, there are features in this battery that made it more desirable to me. First off, remember the channel is called the frugal factor. Cost. These were very competitively priced, but there's also a few other features that made them desirable. Because being frugal isn't always just about price. It's about getting the best product, the best materials and resources for your hard-earned money. So I'm going to bring you in a little bit closer and explain some of the really nice things about this battery. First off, this is not the 170 amp hour battery. This is the new 202 amp hour battery. 
the batteries have a digital readout and an on off button so delivered new out of the box 13.1 volts now the digital display honestly I really don't need that because where these are going to be stored in the van build I'm not going to be able to see this display I really do like the concept of having the on off button that makes it nice and easy to be able to shut it off when you're working on it or installing it another thing that they have is they are fused right at the battery so if you take the side panel off don't lose that screw now I also took the screws off the top and this is brand new out of the box it's got a little uh, zip tie on the battery we're going to take that off Right there you can see there's a 300 amp fuse okay being fused directly at the battery is a big deal at least for me it is if I didn't buy this type of battery if I bought a battery with the normal posts I would get a fuse that bolts right onto the post because I want the each battery fused to protect the battery and protect myself and all the other electrical right at the battery just in case something catastrophic happens I don't think it's going to but always plan for the worst hope for the best so this fuse is really key now up on top up on top here you can see the BMS is easily accessible in case anything ever happened and you had to replace it you can also take the front cover off and take out the individual cells there are four individual cells that make up this battery right here there's an Anderson connector and here's the Anderson plug that I made up in another video I showed making this up and you can see that they plug right together nice safe quick easy way to disconnect your battery now and and they do connect together very well now what's really nice and I was a little worried about let me plug that back in here You see how much it sticks out here I was concerned about that but I think big battery must have gotten some comments and paid attention to them because it doesn't stick out very far and I like that what they've done is they move the Anderson connector They move the Anderson connector back in the case. You can see if you wanted it further out, there are three screws here. I could move this connector forward if I wanted to get a better grip on it and it sticking out didn't cause any problems with the installation where, where it would be put inside the, uh, inside the van. So I was actually thinking about that before I even purchased them with that plug sticking out but it doesn't stick out very much because they moved it back a little bit so that's really nice now one thing I will say is that uh, big battery they sell these cables on their website 
but currently the cables that they sell only come with six gauge wire and not one aught wire the largest size that this connector will take with the proper lugs is a one aught wire which is much thicker than a six gauge okay uh, this will handle 285 watts and that's because of the connector this zero aught cable for the less than five feet that it's going to go will handle much more amperage than the connector but remember we got a 300 amp fuse here so I know that all of these will handle the current that might go through this wire and that's very important buying lithium-ion batteries for your van build is as important as buying a refrigerator a washer or dryer for your home because these things are going to last 10 years. The lithium ion technology is that good. Now, almost all the lithium ion cells are made in China. The cells in this battery, made in China, they're brand new, high quality cells. The BMS, the assembly, happens in the United States from a company called Big Battery. And I expect they're going to be around a really long time. But if something happens, I can disassemble and if I wanted to do it myself exchange parts in this battery that's a real positive for me I'm an electronics guy I like this stuff other people might not be the nice thing about this battery is that it's made in the United States and you could pick up the phone and call big battery and ask or email them questions they're warranted for I believe 10 years so there's somebody in the United States that's going to stand behind the battery. So it's a real positive. Again, I'm not being paid by the company to say this. Uh, it's just this is what I chose. There's other more famous uh, batteries used in van builds, and there's nothing wrong with them at all. But this met the features and cost for me. Now, in a future video, I will do a capacity test on this once I get my inverter and other electronics set up and we'll see if this actually does put out the 202 amp hours each that it specified because this is the frugal factor I want to make sure I'm getting what I'm paying for so please if you like this video hit the thumbs up subscribe and hit that little notification bell and YouTube will notify you when I do the capacity test and of all the future videos Thanks for watching. Hope to see you on the next one.